Rashad Evans, Thiago Silva, UFC 108. Check your local listings. Well, I had to work on my hands. I did a lot more hitting pads with Greg Nelson, and then I sparred some more. But I only had two and a half weeks to do it because I just found out about two and a half weeks ago. Usually I like to do takedowns on people too, but uh, with this guy, I know he's a good wrestler, so I don't, I don't, you know, I might go for a takedown, but probably not. You know, I'm probably trying to gonna keep it standing, you know, instead. So. Well, he's not gonna submit me. That's for sure. He's uh, he's never fought a wrestler before or a guy that has my my main strength is wrestling and jujitsu. And his main strength is stand-up. So I'm assuming he's going to be throwing a lot of knees and he's going to be trying to stay standing. That would be smart for him to do that. I think I've been kind of sloppy with my striking lately. You know, I haven't trained it so much. But uh, but now for this fight, I've been working a lot on it and I feel a lot sharper than I usually been, you know. I'm going to punch my way and I'm going to, I'm going to get a body lock on him or an underhook. Even if he gets an underhook, I'm going to do what Paulo did to me, which was pretty sweet, an outside foot sweep. Uh, you know, I try to be relaxed as possible and, and not put pressure on myself. You know, that's the best way to, 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 to go in the, in the fight, I think. But, uh, you know, just try to stay relaxed and keep focused, you know. Rashad Evans, Thiago Silva, UFC 108. Check your local listings.